All right, so if you want to seriously immerse yourself in a tasty pasta footage, I'm going to be summing up some of the main things to know about using Parmesan cheese and how long it's good for in this video. So does Parmesan cheese go bad? The fact is that yes, it does. And the interesting thing is that different types of Parmesan cheese are fresh longer than others. So the first thing you should know is that when you're storing a block of Parmesan cheese, um, you it's actually gonna last longer than storing uh, grated Parmesan cheese, powdered Parmesan cheese, or shredded Parmesan cheese. So a block of Parmesan cheese, when you get it home from the store, you can actually leave it out at room temperature like they do when they're selling it in the store. And un while it's unopened, it'll stay there for probably a few months but of course it could go up to a year. You just have to check the date on the package. Freezing Parmesan cheese is actually only recommended if it's already been ground. So um, usually for me, I think it's fine to just put a block of Parmesan cheese in the fridge in a plastic bag and it'll stay fine for months for me. Um, other people swear if they're gonna save it for longer that they'll actually go through a process where they wrap it in wax paper to keep some humidity in the cheese and then wrap it in aluminum foil and store it somewhere like on the bottom of the fridge where it's cold and maybe not gonna get a lot of light. Um, we go through Parmesan cheese pretty fast in my house with all of the food recipes we do at Sip Bite Go. So you'll see that it's in a lot of videos we're eating through it pretty quickly and usually a block of Parmesan cheese will last like one or two months in my house. But um, there's different types of reasons why I might go ahead and use it a little bit longer. And so some of those include that, you know, if I'm a little bit desperate, if I think the Parmesan is past the best buy date, especially if it's shredded, because if it's already shredded or grated Parmesan cheese, I find that it um, goes bad a lot faster in the fridge. Those usually only last like a couple of weeks once they're opened. Um, so ones like that, I like to check that the cheese isn't that old. It should be, you know, maybe one week, two weeks, I don't know, maybe even a month over the expiry date. But if the cheese isn't turning blue, if it's not moldy Parmesan, if it's not forming clumps, um, which comes right before Parmesan cheese molds, um, and it's if it's been completely sealed for a while in the fridge and has no weird odor, then I would probably still eat it personally. But you should do probably whatever you think is best, and that's for most people sticking to the expiration date. And I thought I'd just throw in a couple of fun facts about Parmesan cheese. Um, I find it's really easy to make Parmesan cheese melt at about 90 degrees Fahrenheit because it's dehydrated and it's a harder cheese. It takes longer to melt than others like cheddar or... Um, some brie or gouda, um, but how to make Parmesan cheese melt. My favorite tip is to use something like a microplane. You can buy them for like 15 or $20 and you can thinly shave Parmesan cheese so it melts very easily into hot pasta sauce or on a hot pizza or over some tasty oven baked chicken thighs. Um, you can get recipes for all of my favorite Parmesan ingredient using recipes at Sip Bite Go. Well, I hope this helps you figure out exactly how does Parmesan cheese go bad and the signs that I would personally look for if I'm wondering if my Parmesan cheese has gone bad. Make sure to check out some other videos and tutorials at Sip Bite Go. Cheers!